What's going on guys? My name's Colton and welcome to Quinnipiac Day in the Life. I am currently a senior here at Quinnipiac. Uh, I am a mathematics major and a general business minor and I am from Suffield, Connecticut. I also play on the men's soccer team, as you can see from the jersey in the back. So just to give you guys a quick rundown of what I'm going to be doing today, I've got a very busy day on this Wednesday. Um, I will be heading to President Olean's inauguration up on York Hill. After that, I have my senior thesis presentation, and yeah, it's going to be a good day. This is my roommate, Oscar. He lives upstairs with me. Oscar, would you like to tell us where you're from, what your major is, and what your favorite fruit is? Favorite fruit, all right. I'm from New Zealand. My major is biology. And my favorite fruit, I'm going to go with grapes. grapes. Grapes? What color grapes? Are we talking purple grapes or green grapes? Gotta go purple. Purple grapes? Same purple grapes as the move. Oh my God, what's wrong <laughs> with this kid? <laughs> Croissant, please. Hey, what? Hey, croissant. <laughs> croissant. Yes, please. Okay. And that's it. Thank you. All right. So I just chowed down on some unreal breakfast. Um, now I'm heading up to York Hill campus to meet up with some of my teammates and watch uh, President Olean's inauguration. So this should be fun. All right, so I uh, just pulled up to the People's United Center up on York Hill, where uh, we're gonna be watching President Olean's inauguration. Hello, Aubrey. How are you? Great. Hi. Hi. I'm in here in the hockey stadium here with one of my teammates. Uh, this is Simon. Say hello, Simon. How's it going? Uh, would you like to tell us your year, your major, and your favorite vegetable? Um, I'm a sophomore, um, journalism student, and my favorite vegetable is lettuce. Lettuce? lettuce. You like lettuce. I really like lettuce. They were telling me that you like lettuce. I really like lettuce. Wow. Well, that's very bland of you, but I'm glad that... You like lettuce. That's how I am. What's up, Boomer? How are you, man? Good to see you. <laughs> I have my thesis capstone presentation in about four to five minutes from now. Um, so I'm gonna go prepare for that a wee bit before uh, I give my presentation. Um, down on main campus, the Mount Carmel campus, which is only about two minutes away from here. So a short little drive and I'm there. So I made it to main campus and I ran into my friend Kara. Say hello, Kara. Um, I'm gonna ask you to tell us what sport you play, uh, your major, and your favorite geometric shape. My favorite geometric shape, okay. So I'm Kara, I'm on the women's lacrosse team. I guess now I'm an alumni. That's weird, graduating. huh? Yeah, that is weird. I'm wow. a biomedical marketing major and a global public health minor. And my favorite geometric shape is an octagon. Fibonacci sequence, um, just to recall, is a sequence that starts with one and one, and then every number after that in the sequence is the sum of the two numbers before it. So you start with two ones, and it goes two, then three, then five, then eight, and then et cetera, et cetera. All right, so I just finished my uh, thesis presentation. Um, it went well, and I watched a few of my classmates as well, and they were also very good, so that was fun. Uh, now I'm going to head downstairs where the math department uh, is located. This time I'm meeting with uh, my advisor. I actually switched into the math department my sophomore year, um, so she was very welcoming as my advisor. And uh, 
It has been great. And she actually got me this awesome gift, which I am very thankful for. It's so sweet. But now I will be heading to uh, another class to take an exam. Head to the library now, got about an hour before my next class. Um, our next class is statistics, where we'll be dropping our gyrocopters that we made, uh, which is kind of a big experiment that we've been doing for the past few weeks. I just left the library. I'm heading over to Center of Communications and Engineering, or CCE, as a lot of us call it, um, for our statistics experiment. Uh, so just to give a quick background before you get there, um, we do an experiment where each group creates uh, paper gyrocopters with different specs, and um, we're going to be dropping them off of an atrium. And we are going to see whose gyrocopters can stay in the air the longest and who can be the most precise. So uh, we did our test runs earlier this week and we also constructed our optimal gyrocopters that we thought had the best specs with the best trial times. Um, so now we have our optimal gyrocopters ready to drop. Um, it should be a lot of fun and hopefully my group does well. So. Onward. Today is the culmination of our of our work here on gyrocopter, create gyrocopter challenge. The team that can what create the gyro that takes the longest, takes the longest right? It's bullseye. You got six drops. Perfect score, six out of six. Figure out where your plate's gonna go, figure out who's dropping it, and get three timers. And you've got your person collecting the data. We're gonna go, we're gonna see who can maximize the flight time. You ready to go? So we just finished up our gyrocopter experiments. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, our team didn't have the best mean time um, on the drops, but we did have the most bullseyes. So that was good. Uh, I won a little carabiner. So document our achievements. I'm gonna head over to um, our stadium down here on main campus, uh, right across the street where uh, we have our field hockey field, as well as our soccer and lacrosse, lacrosse stadium, uh, which is all brand new as of uh, last year, so my junior year. Um, so it's been a lot of fun being able to play there for two years. Uh, I've been very spoiled um, compared to the grass field that we had when I first came here. Um, so going to go check that out. Going to go collect all my uh, gear from the locker room uh, before the semester ends. So here we go. Alright, so we made it to the men's soccer locker room, uh, my locker room, which is located right uh, next to, or below, I guess, um, our stadium. Um, so, like I said, really nice. So, I just got home from school. Um, back in my room now, back home. Well, I hope you've enjoyed um, a day in the life of a mathematics major. I'm Colton, and thank you so much for watching.